Good morning dear students. Today we will learn how to measure length with the help of hand span and foot span from class second subject math. Dear students, can you measure the length of this board with your hand span? Yes ma'am, we can measure the length of this board with our hand span. Let's start children. It is a board. Let's see that the length of this board is equal to how many of my hand span? 1, 2, 3. Dear students, the length of this board is equal to the length of my 3 hand spans. Now we will measure the length of this board with Simran's hand span. 1, 2, 3, 4. Dear students, the length of this board is equal to the length of 4 hand span of Simran's hand. When I measured the length of this board with my hand span, then its length was equal to my 3 hand spans. But when we measured its length with Simran's hand, then its length was equal to Simran's four hand spans. The length of board is same, but the length of our hand span is different. Dear students, can you measure the length in any other way except hand spans? Yes, we can measure length with our foot spans. Okay. Then dear Kiran, you will measure the length of this room with your foot span. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Like this way, the length of this room is equal to 20 foot spans of Kiran foot. Can we measure the length with any other thing instead of foot span and hand span? Yes, dear students, we can measure the length with the help of different objects like pencils, sharpeners and matchsticks. Dear students, today we have learned how to measure the length with the help of hand span and foot span. Now it is time for today's question. Our today's question is how can we measure the length of shown board? For this question, we have four options. Option A is hand span. Option B is sharpener. Option C is pencil. And option D is all of the above. We can measure the length of board with the help of hand span, sharpener and pencil. So our correct option is D. So we will put tick on option D. Now time for homework. You will measure length of room with your foot span and length of object with your hand span. Thank you.